This week's In Focus takes us into the world of art with a unique series called the Bemidji Sculpture Walk. Our Mary Keeler caught up with one of the featured artists earlier today. So that's where we get some of these unique colors and styrations. To some, a stone is just a stone, but to others, it's the start of a work of art. My inspiration, you know, is looking for those combinations of stone, you know, things that already look like something and then just finish that. Simon's unique eye for this type of natural treasure caught the attention of the Bemidji Sculpture Walk program, and he's a featured artist on their Meet the Sculptors series. Simon Zorns, the amazing artist from out near Zirkel, Minnesota. Stone carver, wild ricer, maple syrup connoisseur, and producer. Simon says he likes drawing upon Ojibwe symbols for his work, and he recognizes the importance of passing those on. I can always think of something new to carve, but you know, um, we we need some of these symbols that I generate. You know, um, it's not something I thought of. This is just a uh, Ojibwe tradition, so to speak. That just it's not getting handed around enough to amongst. People of white earth. Symbols like the bear are popular for the white earth nation and they also hold the turtle as something important too. The turtle in the 13 moons is really a, a popular item being the lunar calendar for, uh, um, for our region and, and it was kind of a guide to people of where they should be in their progress through the circle of the year. Simon sees this as so much more than just stone carving. I look for the story within a stone. You know, a lot of times the, the stone will tell its own story and you're just looking to finish that little bit of, a, you know, you see a corner of a nose or a little bit of a, a forehead or, or something, you know, and then you just finish it, you know. Aside from presenting his work, he wants people to know just how much natural beauty is around them. For this week's In Focus in Bemidji, Mary Keeler, Lakeland News. Upcoming featured artists include Proposky sculptor Al Bellevue on September 4th and Dragonfly fiberglass artists in October. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.